Welcome to our tutorial about show motion. We're picking up where we left off in our previous tutorial where we learned about the navigation bar. The show motion command is available on the navigation bar. It's the last button on the bar. If you don't see this button, just select it from this menu. We can also access this option via the view menu from the standard toolbar. Let's select show motion. And the toolbar appears at the bottom of our screen. We can click the first icon, that's the pin, to pin it down. Next we have play, stop, turn on looping, new shot, and close. Let's select new shot. We're going to give it a name, I'll call it 001. Under view type, we'll select cinematic. Transition type, fade from black into this shot. Movement type, let's zoom in. Duration will be 3 seconds. And distance, let's make 20. And camera position, we'll select ending point. We're ready to click preview. And here's our preview. Let's click OK to accept. Now we're able to play our animation. To edit the shot, just double click the thumbnail. And here we can edit any of the parameters. Let's cancel out for now. I can also right click on the thumbnail and rename the shot, delete it, etc. OK, let's create another new shot. We'll call it 002. Transition type, cut to shot. Movement type, this time we'll use track left. And the point of the camera will be the starting point this time. Let's enter a value of 20 for the distance. Click Preview. OK, seems to be working fine. Let's click OK to accept our work. And let's put it on loop and play it. Here's our movement. Sliding right. Now it's looping around again. And just press stop to end the animation. And this concludes our overview of the Show Motion tool.